Hey guys, it's Robbie once again, and we are going over sit-ups today. And I gotta be honest with you, sit-ups are probably my least favorite exercise, but I do them because we gotta do things we don't like sometimes, right? But let me show you how it's done. I got Gus here with me, he's ready to go. Um, so we're gonna do sit-ups. So the first thing we need to do with a sit-up is here at CrossFit Reach, we use an ab mat. So uh, Gus will show you what that looks like right here. Um, it's an ab mat, it's a pretty simple thing, but it's gonna help you out with your sit-ups. And that goes right underneath your uh, lower back, and that basically takes your lumbar spine out of the equation, so it focuses more on your abdominal muscles. So, now in terms of the sit-up, the way you're gonna be seated, um, you'll see Gus right now is demonstrating a standard sit-up with his feet, okay, so his feet are in a standard position. Uh, you can also do them in a butterfly sit-up, which would be having your feet together, so the soles of your feet touching, nice and close to your body, all right, um, with your knees flared out. Uh, so either way, it's personal preference, what you want to do. Um, so Gus is gonna go into a sit-up, so he's gonna go all the way back, and the key here is his shoulder blades touching the ground, okay, one or two hands behind his head, and from here, he's gonna come forward, use momentum, all right, touching in front of him like so, to get that full range of motion all the way down and all the way up. Okay, it's important to stay in a good rhythm, nice fluid movement, and to stay nice and even, and remember to breathe as you go through this movement. Okay, so here we have it, the sit-ups. 